Well, today I'm changing the uh, courtyard garden it's, uh, mount from uh, basically <coughs> rotted down um, what they call this wood chips to um, stones and pebbles. And these are my uh, our roses with a bit of cypress and wisteria. So I first started uh, this project by laying the uh, rocks around to make a. Um, a border for the uh, plants around the trunks. Once I'm happy with it, I can then uh, you know s start to lay some newspaper like so around it. <coughs> this is to prevent um, uh, weeds or grass from uh, you know other plants that I don't want from uh, germinating and, and uh, coming through the um, small little uh, pebbles. So this section I've already uh, you know completed. So you can see the um, every plant I have a, a circular row of uh, rocks around it. And um, under those, there would not be any paper, so we want the uh, you know rainwater to seep through as quickly as possible. Um, okay, so it's all done. So it's, it's just a matter of uh, using buckets um, and pouring down the uh, pebbles, <laughs> cover the um, area as much as possible. Oh, the birds! And uh, now the aeroplane is going. Anyway. No, I'll just let the aeroplane go first. Okay. Anyway, um, this sort of garden uh, it is very suitable for dry climate like California or the Mediterranean or Australian, where the summer is very dry and uh, is you know you are in a fire-prone area. Thanks for watching.